here is my haul. I've tried to film this already, but um, the bad thing about using your phone at night is people call you. So, I went to the consignment sale. This is my haul. It wasn't too big. I spent 25 bucks. I bought 10 things, so that was about $2.50 a thing. Hopefully that math is right. I'm horrible at math. The first thing we got was this sweet little pink one. Um, it's one of those for real ones. He's real cute. The only thing he was missing was the little bottle. But um, Olivia does, you know, just touches his tongue or feeds him Cheerios. And she really loves him. He's actually in really nice condition. They had a bunch of these, and I think these are so adorable. I think I would love these, like, if they would have had these when I was a kid. Cool, baby. And um, they had, like, a pig, a cat, a duck. But this one was actually the nicest condition, and they were all marked down to $3. Um, and the little girl, actually, that I watch, her sister fell down and broke her arm, fell off their bunk pit and broke her arm. And um, her sister her sister has um, this. They got this for her for, like, a being brave. So, um, yeah, she really loves them. This is the one she picked out, and she thinks this guy is pretty cool. Do you love your penguin? Yeah. Here you go. Anyways, so here's the clothes. That was the only thing I got. Um, I got this little Chiefs dress for um, our friend's little girl. They're big Chiefs fans. And um, for some reason, my phone, of course, is... Hang on, let me wipe off the camera. Maybe that'll be better. No, of course not. Anyways, um, and they're big Chiefs fans. Um, I actually picked them up. Like, I, I could go earlier since I was a consigner. So I bought for them a little dress. They had me buy it for them. And so I bought them this dress as well. And I might save it for her birthday because she's a teeny tiny little thing. Her birthday's in November. And she just turned um, one in November. And so I might keep this for her birthday because I'm also going to make her like some bows. Chief bows. So I might keep it and give it to her then. I don't know. Who knows. And it was $2.50. So super cute. I almost bought this the first day so I was glad that was still there and I didn't buy it for price. Now these are some 3T really cute little fishy short alls and they are um Lily Pulitzer. Um I'd really never heard of Lily Pulitzer before. They were um 250. Um but I actually watch um sometimes I watch um Blair who does the beauty channel and her and her sister used to have like a cute little shop with like online shop with things in it and they always used to have Lily Pulitzer stuff. So I thought these were really cute. I actually looked at these the first day too, but I didn't really want to spend $5 on them. So these will be good, I think, for next summer. They look pretty big. I got these Baby Gap plaid shorts. They were a dollar. They were uh, 3T. They're just really kind of cute. They have this cute detailing on the side. Look at this cuteness. Are you giving him your squisher? Oh, he's so cute. And they're just this like nice, comfy cotton material. Um, I think this might work for this year and next year. Um, these are those infamous shorts I was talking about in the first video. Um, the ones that work, I thought were called like teeny weeny or something, which would be so inappropriate. Um, but they're called shorty shorts and they're brand new. And, um, hold on. You can tell they have this sweet little strawberry detailing. I'm so mad. My camera is blurry. Of course, it was perfect before. And the cute classic Levi look on the back. Um, and they do have this in them. So they may end up being like my favorite shorts. But they're on sale for two or on, um, half off for $2.50. So I figured at that price, I couldn't pass them up. This was the only full price thing I got. It's a children's place. Um, 24 month dress. Brand new. As you can see, it has the little sticker thing on it. I got this because I adore polo dresses, number one. I like children's place, number two. And number three, she had this when she was about three months old, and it was my favorite thing, and I, she used to wear it all the time. So as you can see, it was only four bucks, and I love this dress. It's so cute. I, like, want to put it on her right now. So I was willing to pay four bucks for it. Um, this is a Crazy 8 sweater. It looks like in brand new condition. looks literally like I just bought it off of the store. Um, it has a little boat that wraps around it. I adore these colors. I actually think she has maybe a bow that matches like this collection. Because she has a bow that has all of these colors in it. Um, it was 250 
and it's in 2T, but it looks really large, so I think it'll fit her for a long time. So that makes me happy. Um, this dress I was so happy to find. It's a 3T. It's a sweet little Jimbabwe dress. Um, it has these cute butterflies on it. The cute cool grain detail and the Peter Pan collar. It was three fifty, and it has this adorable, sweet little bow on the back. I love that Jimbery usually puts that sweet detailing on the back. Um, and so I can't decide. I'll be heartbroken if she doesn't fit into this next spring and summer. So I don't know if I should try to put it on her this year, or if I could pull it off in the winter, even though it's like a springtime dress. I don't know. I could put like a white cardigan on it, you know on it with it but I think it's so cute and I couldn't pass it up for 350 I think it's adorable I also got this Jimbri dress which now the the moment is ruined because I the first time I filmed there was like a bunch of dirt right here actually I think there's still some more on it oh yeah because I think this rubbed against my van or something I don't know I could be wrong maybe it's self stained up and I just got a rip off I don't know but um this is like a light blue with these three cute um, navy stripes. And I love the detailing up here of the little kind of like flap with the um, button. Let's see if it has anything in the back. Nope, nothing in the back. This has a liner, so it's a bit floofier. But still, really cute. See, look. But I believe it's just dirt. So I wonder if somebody carried this around and kind of rubbed on the floor. So, oh, that was three bucks. So I was happy to find that. Last thing are these two T Baby Gap. I think these are like kind of the same line. I think they're called the Playtime Shorts. Um, and I was just thinking today, like, oh, I wish I would have got her some more like cottony shorts. So I think these would be good. These have just a cute little butterfly um, on them, and they're white. They're, I believe, they have the same type of band as those other ones. Yeah, they do. And um, just simple. I think it's all gone, baby, baby girl. And just real cute. They were, uh, how much? $1.50. And so I thought for that price, they were a good deal. So, yeah. That was my haul. I don't know if I'll go to that. Uh, stay out. We have one next week. We're also leaving right after that. And I'm um, going on vacation. And sometimes we go on vacation, we shop. So... It's a double-edged sword. But yet, I'll probably be like that hoarder I was talking about and be like, oh, I'm going to miss out on something. So, I don't know. My husband might kill me if I go. So, who knows. But he also really likes the stroller that we got, the one that my mom wanted to buy from us. So, he just says like, oh, maybe we can look for one at that other sale. So, haha, that might be my scapegoat. I remember last year I went and I was like, babe, I'm just going to look. I'm just going to look, maybe for stuff for next year, and I end up getting a lot. So, anyways, so that's all for tonight, and see y'all later. Have a good night. Bye. Let's say bye. Dad. Yeah, you pulled apart the whole diaper bag. Say bye. Bye. Bye.